<laughs> oh, I forgot I even have a shotgun. Well, I'm out of explosives, so I guess I can switch to my shoddy. Oh, a note. Is it worth it? Ow. <laughs> glitch, glitch, glitch. Oh, that really just break the game. Night dog! Yeah, almost had me, night dog. Almost had me. Jenny, sending along some extra beef, grapefruit, and potatoes I just got. We're seeing the best crop we've had since we've settled here. Please make sure mom gets fatty cut. She looked too skinny. Whatever. Pat, you almost broke Naughty Dog's game. How does it make you feel? They spent literally years trying to make this. Okay, that is not the song I thought it was. I wonder if this is an original song or if it's a... Uh music they got from something else. Did I just go in a circle? Fucking went in a circle. Motherfucker. You guys fans of shotguns? Cause... I'm kind of a fan of shotguns. Shotgun, shotgun, shotgun party. Welcome to my shotgun party. Hello. Welcome to the shotgun party. Uh, what happened to that guy's leg? I think I got shotgun partied. Really? I didn't press square enough? Nah, my shotgun party. <laughs> Right? Shotgun party take two. This time, shotgun harder. Ready for this? What I'm gonna shotgun every single one of them with one bottle. I'm gonna burn this dude alive because he's an asshole. And then shotgun party. Ow. Shotgun party's not going any better this time. One guy. Shotgun party. Still not dead though. Shotgun party again. All right, we're over here. We got this jabroni. Shotgun party. All right, this guy too. All right, gotta reload the shotgun party. Dodge and weave, dodge and weave. Turn around, dolphin dive. Get up, shoot this guy in the. Oh no, I need to get that shot off the shotgun party to work out. All right, I got him. I have one melee swing on this guy. Oh no, I got shotgun. I thought I killed that guy with my Molotov. Alright, honestly, we should put on some of these trap mines, because they're pretty nasty. They do work pretty well. Obviously, they worked really well against... Alright, I'm going to get this guy off of Molotov first. And clap. Shotgun party. Alright, let's see if they start running into my explosives. All right, let's see. That. Ah. Uh, huh. Peekaboo. Shotgun party. Welcome to my shotgun party. Welcome to my shotgun party. Uh, I gotta hand it to you. That was a pretty good fight. Pretty good party, too. Is that shotgun ammo? For my shotgun party? Aw. You shouldn't have. You better start running. Hmm. Hello! No, you. No, you.
Well, that shotgun party was a success. What do you guys think? I think it was pretty successful, honestly. Everyone seemed to enjoy their time. Everyone got their party favors, especially this guy. Do they have any souvenirs left over for me? Doesn't really look like it. Well, I did host the party. That's fair. Oh, there we go. That's all I needed, baby. One more shotgun. Uh, in we go. More party time. Who asked for a shoddy? Like a melody in my head. Ellie is literally massacring a whole entire organization just to kill one person. Uh. Think this will work? Nope. Why'd I even try? Who are you? Is that Abby in there? Is Abby watching this? Oh, did I just gouge her? Oh, that's not good. Hey, you're welcome, guys. Prison break. Prison riot. Right, come on, let's go. Hey, well, where's Abby? Who? She's bit. Keep back. Hey, don't put that fucking thing in hey, me. Hey, 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 hey. Abby tried to escape. She's down in the pillars. The pillars? Head down to the beach. You won't miss it. Thank you, skinny, pale guy. Right. Oh, well, that's a shame. That guy's giving me some weird eyes. Not that guy, the other dude. A really redneck looking dude. Well, this is dark and mysterious. One shot. Do not miss your chance to blow. Can we get a drink? Mm, guess not. You guys are lucky I already killed like half their army for you. Maybe we shouldn't have done such a big, mighty fall. Probably should have uh, landed on that couch or something. Or just like slid down this, like yabba dabba doo. Oh, that's already on fire. Well, the world goes to shit pretty fast around these parts. So Abby's been holed up by these assholes in Santa Barbara for a couple months now? Kinda sucks. I want her to get to Catalina. That looks like a pillar, kind of. Oh. Oh, there she is. Hello? Do I say hi to her? 
Or is that not her? Oh, who's this? Oh. They cut her hair? Is that like a bait and switch? Like someone that used to the, the old Abby and now this is poor Abby now fucking the shell of who she used to be? Fuck, this is depressing. I came all this way to kill you, you know. Fuck me, are we all gonna die on a boat to Catalina Island? What a weird way to end this game. That's what happens. Santa Barbara's honestly not that far from Catalina Island. It's probably a couple hours. Six, maybe. Seven. Oh, it's the loading screen. I can't let you leave. I'm not doing this. Well, looks like you're doing this. What the fuck, you Ellie? You made him a part of this. Okay. Okay. Oh my goodness. All I want to do is get to Catalina Island at this point. Oh shit!
this really worth it, Ellie? I don't know at this point. Oh, ow. She's clearly suffered enough. Uh, oh, 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 my goodness. Oh. oh, is revenge worth it this much? Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh shit. Oh. Oh shit. Square, square, square. Oh my goodness. Oh! Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee! This is brutal! Ow! Ow! Dude, uh... This isn't worth it. This isn't worth it. She bite her whole finger off? Pinky, and honestly, ring fingers are kind of useless. The house doesn't look as well kept as last time I was here. Maybe that window seal has always been down or the shutter. Oh shit, is it empty? 
Oh no! Oh no! Oh she even took my fucking guitar? Really? She even play guitar? Can't believe this. Well, she did the sheets for the next owners. That was uh nice of her, I guess. Oh, she did leave my stuff. Fuck me. If I ever go to lose you, oh fuck. Oh, she saw him that night? Seth under control. Yeah. And you need to stop harassing Jesse about my patrols. That was just one kiss. It doesn't mean anything. She just... I don't know why she did that. But you do like her.
idea of what that girl's intentions are, but... But I do know that she would be lucky to have you. You're such an asshole. I'm not trying to... I was supposed to die in that hospital. My life would have fucking mattered. But you took that from me. Somehow, the Lord gave me a second chance at that moment. I would do it all over again. I don't think I can ever forgive you for that. But I would like to try. That was pretty good. <laughs> she never got the chance. forgive Joel so she decided to forgive Abby instead that's why that was the moment she saw when she let her go
Wow. I might do a, a separate video where I review it a little more in depth, but overall it was, that was pretty good. Definitely had some problems pacing. Dialogue, the inner character moments were beautifully written. A lot of the action sequences were pretty breathtaking. The the driving sequence of Jesse riding the horse through the burning scar camp. A lot of the big open locations like that one opening sequence in Seattle where you can just roam around on the horse and explore everything just really felt a lot less restricting than the first game there was a lot of different paths you could do to every encounter and um even the boss encounters really stepped it up that fight against the super infected monster in the bottom of the basement of the hospital that was crazy Getting us to care about the character of Abby after making her do such a, a horrific action in the opening of the game is pretty spectacular. Obviously, he doesn't really have a happy ending because now Ellie's all alone. Was it worth it? I don't even know if she knows. Now she's free from her... Her demons, at least. And Abby gets to go to Catalina Island. Obviously, Gustavo... Slayed with the... The music. Every nook and cranny. Clearly I didn't get all the collectibles in the game despite as hard as I tried to get every coin, quarter, card, and whatnot. Because I think I would have gotten an achievement for that. But you know, I tried. I tried to get everything. And the fact that as hard as I tried to explore everything, there's still more to explore is pretty crazy. The new enemy variety, like the Shambler and the Stalker, are very cool. I didn't expect them to really add more zombie types just because it's kind of a more grounded take. Like, they weren't going to get super crazy, like Left 4 Dead or even um, Dying Light. But, you know, they got, they got a little creative. I guess the wolves and the scars were kind of an allegory for... Ellie and I guess Abby or just revenge in general they demonstrated that violence isn't the answer because they as we were leaving the island everyone was dying no one was making that other alive so you either had to forgive and forget or go down in flames I love how they didn't specifically say that they named the baby Joel Jr. They just teased it with the JJ. Overall, it was a very worthy successor to the first game. If not a very different game in its own right. A really different story.
The first game was about Joel discovering what it's like to be human again after being shelled up for so long. And this game was more about learning to accept your own emotions and trauma and not put it on other people. There was a, a post credit scene at the end of Uncharted 4. I don't know if there will be for this one, since that was a very poignant ending. But maybe we'll get to see Abby and Catalina. But, I don't know. Who played Abby? Oh, Jeffrey Wright was Isaac. Lol. Remember how I said he looks like the guy from Westworld slash Felix Leiter in Casino Royale? That's because he was the guy from <laughs> Casino Royale in Westworld. Jeffrey Wright. Lol. He, he did well with what he was given. He didn't have a lot of screen time, but he kind of had a commanding presence when he was there. motion capture? Oh, I guess that was for the, the bar scene. Animal performers? That's cool. They got actual horses to model for the in-game. Ooh, the weapon sound recording? That's kind of cool. That'd be a fun job to have. Do all the... The... The gaffing... Not gaffing, the... Um... Foley. Do all the foley for a video game. I thought this, these credits would be rolling around to the end at some point. The Lemon Babies. I guess those are babies that were born during the production of this game. Well, this, this game was in production for so bloody long, I'm surprised it wasn't more. Those babies are probably like young adults by now. There's a lot of companies that help Naughty Dog out with, I guess, just other random assets and extra work here and there. Probably a lot of random fine-tuning of, like, certain locations, playtesting, adding in, like, last-minute details and whatnot. Thank you, Sony. Thank you for not overdoing the product placement in this game. Gustavo Santoliaia. He, um, I don't know if I mentioned this when I first was talking about the music, but he did music in a lot of Alfonso Coron movies. He also did some of the music in Narcos Mexico, the new season. Maybe it wasn't Alfonso Crown. Maybe it was, um... The... The Revenant director. Birdman director. Um... Alejandro G. Naratu. One of them. Maybe he's worked with both of them, honestly. He's a really prolific score guy. Whenever you need an acoustic guitar score, he's your man. I'm just 
just a poor Whoa. wayfaring stranger. I did not expect to get a song. All right, let's just enjoy this. This world of woe. There is no sickness, no toil, nor danger. They're gonna put this on Spotify or something. The first game soundtrack's on Spotify if you guys haven't checked it out. You know how hard it is to sing in the voice of a character? Like, shout out Troy Baker. And go sing in home to God. I'm going there to see my Savior. I'm going there no more to Space Needle Walkman, did you see all those funny, uh, Ice Cube, look at Ice Cube getting all the credits. I really like the, the credits for all the, like, copyright stuff they use, it's like Taylor Guitar, I guess the Space Needle is copyrighted for some reason? Guess that was it. Hope you guys enjoyed the Let's Play The Last of Us 2. Holy shit, it's Catalina! No way! No way, dude! That is sick! Avalon's looking a little shabby. It doesn't exactly look like the casino, but it's close enough. I'll give it to him. Hope you guys enjoyed. Wow. What an ending. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next Let's Play.
For my life, can't say that girl Don't tell me you can say that shit All she want is payback for the way